Today I gave myself a little challenge. It's very exciting. I brought a pair of scissors and I have a string in my pocket. Starting here from the local shop in my very small village, Kalvsvik in south of Sweden. And I'm going to do a short walk to a nearby lake and making a bouquet of wild flowers meanwhile. This is a bit tricky because I don't really know what I need. I just don't want to go back and to get something that I, well, find out that I need. I just, I just pick it and I have no idea if I have use for it, but well, we'll see. <laughs> This one is a flower or a plant that I love, some extra. In Swedish we call it elk grass and uh, my mom used to make tea from this plant so she picked and dried the flowers and then simply use it with uh, boiled water and the smell is just uh, wonderful and to me this is like family smell. <laughs> I really like it. I don't know what this flower is, but it sure looks like a wild carrot. It is so beautiful, but it makes me a bit confused. I didn't know it was like growing here. Uh, yeah, that's why I try to recognize the smell and it's definitely like carrots. It will go so, so well along with this purple long flower.
think I kind of like what I see. It was a bit tricky to do this bouquet because I missed the colors. But I think it's okay. It's also a bit tricky because some of the flowers are a bit tired. <laughs> so they don't look like the best or their best. But I will give it a soak of water directly into the lake uh, before going home. And this will look absolutely beautiful in a vase in my kitchen table. It's a bit of um, this walk put together and I will enjoy it when coming back home.